Hey guys, it's me, Sydney Marie, and welcome back to another video of me trying to teach you how to bake something. Let's get started. Today we are making homemade jam. So I like to call this jam from a can because the first thing you're gonna need is a can of fruit. Then you're also gonna need sugar and lemon juice. Lemon juice helps it keep its color and so that it doesn't get too sweet like a syrup. So the first thing you're gonna do is take your pot and put it on medium heat and then you're gonna dump in your can of fruit. Today I'm making pineapple jam. Next thing you're gonna do is start adding in your sugar. You want to do three fourths cup of sugar to every eight ounces of canned fruit. And then you're gonna do a fourth cup of lemon juice as well. And then mix it. You want it to get to like a little bit of a boiling point. It's a little bit more than a simmer, um, but it's not like a rapid boil, just so that you can cook down the sugar and cook down the fruit. I like to add in my sugar little by little, but you can honestly just add it in all at once. It's completely up to you. Now don't mind my stove, I definitely see it now, but I totally forgot to clean it after making coffee. Oh, my life. Yeah, anyways, <laughs> you're just gonna keep adding in your sugar until you've got all your sugar that you need and you're gonna keep cooking it down. You want it to hit this consistency that's a little bit thicker than syrup, but not exactly jam, because when it does cool, it does thicken up. So you don't want like a jam jam right away or else you're gonna have this like hard rock of craziness. So next you're gonna put it in a jar. I like to reuse jars. Um, I'm reusing a pasta jar right now. I feel like it was like cheese pasta. I don't know, I washed it, it's fine. But hey, free jar. So now I'm gonna fill it full of all the jam and I'm gonna put it in the fridge for about an hour to set and cool down. Now mind you, if you do mess it up, it's totally fine. Just add a little water to into it and stir it. It's, it's fine, it'll, it'll work. It'll work for what it is if you really mess it up. Now, if you're like me and you're trying to do good and not gain weight during quarantine, you have rice cakes everywhere. So put your jam on a rice cake and snack away. It's healthier than a piece of bread, apparently, but you know, with the jam, probably not. It's still dessert. It's delicious. I like to add cinnamon on top of my jam. But yeah, it's super easy and you feel fancy making your own jam. What can I say? That's why I shared it. Anyways, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel for new recipes every week. Love you guys. Bye.